So in this video, we're going to be turning all of this into this. Now, just in case you're wondering why I'm wearing these gloves, that's because I'm going to be using this glue. And I hate getting this on my fingers, as I'm sure most of you do. So the first thing you're going to need to do is, on some of these edges, take a file or something and just clean it up a little bit. It really depends how yours print it, but you just really just need to clean the edges in here and along the outside. Because basically, this one is going to go in here, into this groove here. This one is going to go along this small groove here on the edge. And you also need to clean this edge a little bit because this has this groove in it and that's going to fall into this on top. So let me start by assembling it first. So what we want to do is we want to add some glue on here. I'm just going to use a few dabs in different spots. Then I'll take this piece, put it on here with the ring up this groove. Make sure that it snaps into place. If you can't get it in without the glue, sand it. So that's why, or file it. That's why I filed it first and I make sure that it snapped into place. Next step is I'm gonna add a little glue in the groove here. I'll take the side that I filed and you can see due to the discoloration, it goes in there. So once you put it in there, make sure that it's fairly straight all the way around. Your next step is to put a little bit of glue on this upper groove here. Just hold it in place, giving it time for the glue to basically get hard glue. It is, you know, one of those super glue type products. So it should be pretty quick. And basically, that's what you should end up with. So what is this for? This is going to go on this. This is a half inch Lasco P trap. That is the barcode. I bought this at the big box store that starts with an L. And this will fit in here like this. And this is where your candle will go. So basically this fits a two inch candle like this. And I'll take a picture from the side so you can see it. So basically, it'll look like that. So this is supposed to look like dripping wax. So you just paint this whatever colors you want in order to give it the look. And, you know, the edge is to keep it from falling over. And that's basically the whole assembly of this. You may want to end up gluing this later on once you're done. Any questions, put it below in the comments. Um, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you really enjoyed this video and the project, subscribe to the channel to let me know. And I'll continue making more 3D printed projects for Halloween. Mm -hmm.